guys. <laughs>
these are two glosses I've got one is um, they're both collaborations actually so this one was in collaboration with Ellery um, this one is called Netta and then I've got this and this was um, Karuchi and Colourpop's collaboration this was the second collaboration she did with them and this is in the shade Dumpling so Netta is quite dark and I like that about it and Dumpling is really light it's lighter than what I thought it was going to be I think the um, lip gloss is actually retail for six dollars um, if not then I'll put the correct price so the next items I got are gel eyeliners now um, my eyes over the last probably two three years have been so sensitive I I find it hard to put um, liner in my waterline because I just start crying instantly these came out a long while ago and um, I needed to get them so they're really creamy and they are comfortable in the eyes and when I do get a chance I am definitely definitely going to buy some more so these are the shades that I've got they're all really brightly colored these are the swatches look how pigmented those are like it's so nice I don't even like lining my waterline anymore but we've got to also um i got a pigment it was um kathleen lights um collaboration with colourpop um and she came out with a whole like um astrology kind of collection the pigment i got is actually this one so lo and behold it is the fish so um as i've stated before if you haven't watched my get to know me tag go and watch it like pause this and go watch it now <laughs> um i'm a pisces and my birthday's on march the 14th this i had to get because the, why not <laughs> this is in my star sign so why the hell not and to be honest it is a very nice color so um let me just can i even boy i tried i i don't know how these these people managed to swatch successfully but um I don't think I'm one of them. This is the shade. It is the fish. And they've got so many different ones, obviously, because it's not just my star sign that's in Zodiac. Last but not least, um, I actually got um, one of Colourpop's eyebrow pencils. Now, this is something I've been meaning to get for a very, very long time. This is the Precision Brow Pencil. So if you know me, I'm always on the hunt for um a pencil that is literally like my next baby like any kind of slim precision brow pencil i'm all over it i actually got the shade um what shade is this cool cocoa i was debating whether i should get this one or banging brunette and i decided on cool cocoa it is darker than what i thought it would be um so is very cool tone. I don't know if you can actually see that um, or if my camera's focusing, but that's what it's like on my hand. It is definitely a more um, cool tone brown, but I mean, I can't expect anything else. It's, it's called Cool Cocoa, so. Next on the list is <laughs> our good old friend, Superdrug. Everyone has the same problem that I do with Superdrug and at least I know that I am not alone. You go into Superdrug for one thing, one thing and end up with 10 million others. You'll get to the till and the cashier is now telling you that your total is £73.86 and you don't understand how you got there when all you came in for was deodorant. That wasn't my problem this time. This one was planned because I saw that Superdrug, of course, had on their very well-known promotion, which is the three for two um, on beauty products. So I was like, okay, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna help myself to a few things here. I'm gonna start with setting sprays now. This one I was unsure of. Um, this is the Glow Revolution. It's even changing as we speak. This is the Glow Revolution Prime Set and Glow Illuminating Face and Body Spray. Guys, I want the body lava. I want the Fenty body lava so bad, but I can't fathom spending 46 pounds for it. So, I mean, I'm gonna have to make do with this. 
this is not the same obviously but um hopefully this will give me the glow that i'm wanting in the summer this is in the shade timeless bronze so as you can see it's changing but what you do you shake it up and all the color comes into it and you just see it swirling around looking all pretty i'm gonna be some bronze baby in the summer i'm going to look good with a t this was um 10 pounds um i've heard that the spray gets caught cool and i mean it's not that deep for me if it, if it does get caught cool, like the bits in it I'll, I'll put it in a different bowl the second thing i purchased um was the revolution sports fix setting spray i've actually used this it's described as extra hold makeup fixing spray this actually works this works let me tell you this i've wore this um setting spray to my mum's birthday party now i was in a hot kitchen all night um literally serving food running up and down i did my makeup before i got to the venue and i set up the venue me and my sister were in the kitchen cook it like and this is a spray i used and um one day if i can insert a clip like this is how it looked by the end of the night i can't remember the price of this um i'll put it in the description box but yeah guys if there's anything that you need from this haul is this the third spray i actually picked up was the elf mist and set spray i use elf brushes and i've been riding with elf for probably about eight years now but i've never used this this is the matte magic mist and set because they've got two so this is the matte one i used it today actually um it's okay it's not it's just I, now i found a revolution one i'm sold on that one but this one is it's still good i think this was five pounds i'll put a price down in the description box but yeah um this is still a good spray um but i bought this i also bought this brow pencil so this is the MUA Brow and Define um, Micro Precision Eyebrow Pencil. I used this one in the tutorial and guys, um, 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 it's not NYX. I don't think anything is going to beat NYX, but, but I will be using this one on an everyday basis. Anytime I do my brows, like look at this brow, like this brow is lit. It's so nice. Like. I've already started putting people onto this. I'm not even going to lie to you because Nick's need to chill. Um, I cannot, uh, I'm, I will not buy that pencil for £10. So they really need to chill. So this is kind of cool tone, um, just like the um, Colourpop one. I also got the um, Makeup Revolution um, foundation stick. So that's what it looks like. So essentially I bought this to highlight with. Um, I don't know how well it's going to work because I've just, hmm, hmm. It's very creamy and um, me and creamy, creamy products don't really mix. Especially under my eyes at least. It can't be too, too creamy because um, it's just not going to work. It's going to separate and all of that jazz. I also got the shade in F15. So this one I bought to contour. Now, again... It's very creamy. It looks kind of shiny. So I don't know if it's emollient based. Um, I think that these are going to work well. Well, especially the contour one. The contour one is going to have me snatched. I love a creamy contour stick. Like it can't, that, that's one thing that can't be dry. Um, under eyes, I can have it probably a bit drier, but this contour can't be dry eye wise um i bought the revolution cut crease canvas um this is supposed to be like an eyeshadow base and i actually believe it's supposed to rival the p louise base this is in the shade create and this is what it looked like i used this um to create my cut crease today and i have no problems with it you know it it, it seemed okay to me um it just didn't dry down completely it comes with this brush, but I won't be using that brush because I can just imagine it getting dirty. This is the shade. It's quite light, as you can imagine. Yeah, they've got different shades, so I'm going to assume for different skin tones, which is good as well. So the next thing I actually got was the Revolution Prime and Lock Primer. To be honest, I'm not really feeling this that much. I mean, maybe it's because I used it for the first time. I wasn't too sure 
on what it was going to be like i'm gonna try it again and i'm gonna play around with it um just to see how it goes but at the moment i'm 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 not really moved. I'm not really moved on it. But this was like six pound or something as well. And I'm just like, for the price, I'm very sure this could have been better revolution. Like, but. So moving on to concealer, I actually got the e.l.f. 16 hour camo wear concealer. I bought these in two shades. I bought, this is the one in deep olive. And I also got deep chestnut just in case because i ordered these online um i tried to watch as many reviews online as i could um and i was pretty scared about this um shade actually the deep olive because a lot of people that i i shade match myself to were like no um deep chestnut is probably a better match this is too yellow i can't find it right now so i can't even show you um but i'd like to use deep chestnut on my eyelids um if i'm going for a no eyeliner look and this for under the eyes to brighten it's got a big doe foot applicator um and is very 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 yellow based um that's it but i it, personal preference i actually prefer my concealers to look more yellow in tone i used this as well um today for my eyes and i think we can agree that my under eyes look pretty damn good this was five pounds i think <laughs> so the second concealer i got is the nyx can't stop won't stop concealer this is in the shade warm honey have i actually used the can't stop won't stop foundation on my channel i don't remember but Listen, when I tell you that is my favourite drugstore, favourite drugstore foundation. Best believe when I found out they was coming out with concealers, I was stalking. I was stalking. I was like, yo, 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 yo. I actually bought this online. Again, I shade matched myself via videos and there weren't much videos out. Not as many as um, the foundation. This is the um, doe foot applicator. So it's pretty similar tone and shade to the one that i tried before the elf one yo this concealer i'm actually gonna get a darker shade to contour and no one needs to talk to me no one needs to talk to me when i've got that nyx on and when i've got the, this nyx on the foundation concealer good night um i actually got a highlight palette um this is the revolution highlight palette i can't remember the name and i can't even remember the shade name and they don't have it on here but this is what it looks like swatch wise i wasn't really impressed um and yeah i was not very best moved by this i wanted to see if this would this would work but mm, i don't know how to describe it it's literally just kind of like dust and i've used better from them so maybe i need to use it properly and I, I, I don't know so i got this powder this is the revolution matte base powder it's from the uh, matte base range this is in the shade p15 i use that to contour today i'm looking for something which is similar to my um cover girl queen collection bronzer that they have sadly discontinued i quite like it it can work i just don't think i'm ever gonna find something that's going to top that last of all i didn't actually buy this so this came um as part of the promotion three for two this is the pretty incredible palette i don't even know i think it's an eyeshadow palette that's what it looks like and i think these two shades are highlight shades i'm not too sure i've got to try this one out i've not actually tried it so you know we will see when I try it and I believe that is the end of my haul <laughs> guys thank you thank you thank you thank you so much for watching until the end of this video um it means a lot it support means a lot and just know that I'm back full time again and I won't definitely won't be leaving you guys for so long again as always I would like to thank you for watching and sticking with me to the end of this video it means a lot um because I did spend quite a bit of money so you know the least you could do is support it girl please don't forget to comment rate and subscribe and if you want to see more of me don't forget to click that notification bell so you never miss an upload from me you can keep up with me on my socials which are twitter instagram and snapchat and all the links will be listed in the description box below and of course guys until the next time remember to stay true remain beautiful and i'll catch you on the next one bye guys